Welcome back, guys, to Kerbal Space Explosion. So, we are still on Minmus, and we are exploring the biomes and getting lots of science. We've been here for two episodes now, hopping around. We rescued Kenrick and Lanbus. We sent Har uh, Hudhat, I, whatever, I think his name. I can't remember their names. I can't keep them straight. But we sent him back to Kerbin. These guys have been hopping around. We explored previously the Minmus Midlands, the Slopes, the Lowlands, and the Greater Flats. We got soil samples, we did Science Junior, we did Mystery Goo, we did EVA. And I think next I wanna hop over to this flat area, and then over to this flat area. And uh, once we have done that, we will see where we, where we are, how much fuel we have left. Um, and see if we can't try to shoot for the poles as well. Uh, we'll see. We'll see what we have left. There's the flag. By the way. Ba -ba. Okay, so we need to go mostly east and a little bit north. Here we go. Uh, buckle up, guys. Five, four, three, two, one, go. And I don't want to go too high. I want to mostly point at the at the horizon with just a little bit of upwards trajectory so we don't run into any mountains or anything and we can get rid of them we're done with you no more science juniors unfortunately and let's throttle up so i can see if we're going the right direction uh yeah it looks like it good i don't actually see there we go Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Actually, I want to go a little further because one, what, what happened? What was that? Oh, that's the fuel tanks landing. Uh, once we actually start to slow down, it's going to kill off that arc. So I want to overshoot a bit, something like that. That'll do nicely. Uh, we'll use SAS this time. Not RCS, SAS, so the thing stays where I puts it. We can pull up the landing legs for a minute, just for fun. It's not actually necessary. Uh, we've got a compact little bundle here. Um, we are going to run out of fuel, and we have to save the fuel, most of it, from these three center guys so that we have enough to get back. Really, we may only need the fuel in this center guy to get all the way back, uh, so I may try to push it. I would like to hit up these two flats in this video, and also the poles. Uh, and then go from there, see what we have left. Depending on whether or not these are unique biomes or whether they're the same one. I know there's another flat area back here on the dark side, which we could try to go to, depending on just how much fuel we have. We're also still missing the highlands, uh, which I tried to find before. And um, maybe on the other side, there's more highlands because the, maybe the relative elevation is higher on that side. I don't know. We will try to figure it out. And I can't go faster than 10 times. There we go. That'll speed it up a little bit. Okay, and then we get to here, and that's good. We're over it. We're over top of it. So let's kill off that angular momentum. Whoa! Whoa! There we go, and then come mostly straight down. It should be a little bit easier to land since we're landing on flats. And like that should be good. We're landing on the flats and we don't have as many wonky things sticking off the edge. We're a, a perfect octagonal shape right now. At least until we, until we lose another uh, fuel tank. Oh. Um, speaking of which, we should probably prioritize what we're going to lose next with the, uh, the goo canisters. We want to use the ones we're going to lose first next. So it looks like this tank right here is going to be the next one to go. We've already used the goo canisters on that side. So when we land here, we should use the goo canisters here on the other side. As soon as we get down here. Come on, guy. I got SAS on. If I move you, you stay. <laughs> yeah, that's me showing it who's boss. Okay, can we speed up here? Let's get on with it. 
There we go. Ooh, we might be right on the edge. We can see if this is something different. It's probably going to be slopes or lowlands. Though, if I were to guess... Yeah, it looks like... I want to come down in the flats. Not the, uh... I don't want to come down over there on the edge. I want to come down on the flat part. That's why I aim for the flats, so it would be flat. And also because it would be a unique biome. Let's see, I think... Let's see, did we do it? Hopefully that's good enough. It seems like we're going to be right on the edge here. Let's put the landing legs back out in case I forget. And let's slow down just a little. Okay, good. Lovely. Very good, very good. Here we come. <laughs> the gravity is so low here, it can take forever to descend sometimes, or at least it feels like that. Okay, getting close. Throttling down. Speed up. Uh oh, crap. Whew. <laughs> Boink! Perfect! Don't tip over, please! Okay, perfect. We landed. Okay, we were going to do Mystery Goo. Uh, we're going to use this tank next. So let's do these two Mystery Goos. 50 science, and then a smidgen more. Whatever this amount is, which would be like 12 and a half or something. Okay, there's that. Uh, then let's get out Dundred. EVA, Dundred! Let go, Dundred! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Dundred! Get out of there! Oh, crap. Don't get stuck, please. Oh, man. This stinks so much when they get stuck like that. Oh, you can fly out. Good. <laughs> fly out, please. Good. Um, first thing I want you to do, Dundred, I want you to get the data out of there. No, no, not EVA report. Out of there. Collect data. Move. Good. Well done, Dundred. And we don't have any more science juniors, so no need to worry about that. Fly up. Let's come over here just a short distance. And let's see what biome we ended up... No, no. Not this way. Stop. <laughs> Gosh, man. Listen to what I'm saying. EVA report. We are in the Minmus Flats. Okay. Uh, keep that. Let's look at the flags we've placed. Greater flats. Okay, so this is new. Whoa. This is definitely new. Minmus flats. Let's get a surface sample. Definitely not made of delicious desert products. They seem to repeat these. Okay, we'll take one of those. Uh, we will plant a flag. Kersplunk. And then we will label it so that I can keep track of where we've been. Midmus Flats. All right, excellent. Back in the command pod with you. And let's fall very rapido. As long as it'll let us. Uh, but we don't want to hit the ground, though. Okay, let's put the legs out. And get ready to throttle up. Actually, we're still kind of high. But I don't want to crash into the ground. If I can at all avoid it, we have a lot of science stored up on here. I'm hoping to get uh, more than a thousand science from this mission. That would be nice. Somewhere in the right in the realm of one thousand to, or to two thousand would be a good amount. So we can unlock a decent amount. The, uh, the Gravioli, I think, is a 500 pointer. It's expensive. The uh, Gravioli detector, or whatever it's called. And I definitely want to take that to Duna, which is the next location on the prices right. And then after Duna, it depends on how much of the uh, how much of the tech tree we've unlocked at that point. We may go to Eve or Moho. Or we may go to the moon with like a one big super mission. Depends on what we've unlocked. I definitely want uh, a variety of docking clamps available before we go to the moon. 
so I can do some docking and undocking in the moon's orbit. Okay, slow down. Easy does her. There we go. Easy peasy. Once you've done this like half a dozen times, it gets much easier. I feel much more confident with it now than I used to be. Uh, plus, I'm probably designing my landers a little better as well. There we go. Plus, Minmus, very easy to land on, very easy to tip over. There we go, we made it. Uh, all right, so let's see. The next set of tanks we're gonna lose is these guys right here. So we've already used these two strange goos. And these two have not been used. Let's use these. Very good. Very good. Okay, and... Dundred, get out and do your thing. Space. Jets. And then come over here and pick up one of the strange goos. Let's zoom in so we can see a little better. Here, not close enough. See how close you have to get to these things? It's crazy. Collect. Remove. Awesome. Oh, and it says Great Flats. Good. Uh, that is a, that's another one we have to get, right? I think we've done Greater and Normal. These are Normal Flats. Those are Greater Flats. These are Great Flats. Cool. So that only leaves Lesser Flats left to discover. Surface Sample. Okay, same flavor text. Take that. Uh, EVA Report. Take that. Plant flag. Blink. Okay, text, and we're gonna say Minmus. Great flats, so we can keep track. There we go. Uh, next, I want to hit up this area here, which is in the dark side of Minmus. So uh, we're throttled down, so let's just speed up time to spin around the thing. Whoa, okay, that's far enough. Perfect, yeah, this big area right here. Let's see what that gets us, and let's fly around over there. Lights on, oh, you can see the edge of the texture there. You see that, that was funny. You can see where the texture stopped, like the shadow hit it in a weird way. Ooh, look at that, that's dramatic. Okay, and let's throttle up, I guess. Looks like this this hop is going to be a little farther than the other ones. Yep, hop, hop. Good. Oh, we're going to go quite high with this one. And we can put the landing legs up for a second. The lights look kind of nice when you're on the dark side. Oh, and look, the rocks are kind of uh, reflecting light a little bit. It looks really cool. Oh, and there's the sun. Here, let's watch the sunrise. Zoom, 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 zoom. We need some cool sound effects or music. And I can't warp faster than one times. All right, here we come in for another landing in another area of the flats, which we just hopped across to. We're coming in hot. <laughs> Better slow down. Uh-oh. We're coming in fast. Slow down. Put your landing legs down. Put your landing legs down. Slow down. Put your landing legs down. Slow down. Sounds like a uh, do -si do like a four square or a uh, square dancing song. All right. Oh, and I can no longer see our trajectory. Just need to come down as straight down as possible so we don't tip over in the low minimus gravity. There we go, there we go. Boink. There we go. Are my lights still on? My lights are still on, even though it is bright out. All right, we set down. That was pretty much perfect. Okay, so um, we still have the tanks left over uh, from the, uh, the strange goo canisters that we've used. Let's see, we've used that one. Next, we will be losing this one. So let's go ahead and use these. And it looks like we're probably going to get to use all of them. Click on that, click on that. Okay. Uh, Dundred, get out! 
do your thing. The ones I just did were these two, I think. I'm not exactly sure. Do your thing. You've done it enough. It should be a routine by this point. And after this, we're going to the poles. Whoa! No, no, no. <laughs> Careful. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Remove. Okay, we got it. Good. Mission achieved. Check that out. Kerbin and the moon are aligned with Minmus. That is freaking awesome. Or it kind of looks that way. Maybe not exactly. Maybe it's a trick of the I EVA report. EVA report for Minimus's lesser flats. Yes. Okay. So, hmm. We've obviously already have the uh, EVA report from here because it's given me a value of zero. But I'm pretty sure that the surface sample we still get almost full value. We, we transmitted. See the the little amount of gray there. That's the amount we transmitted last time, I think. Okay. Uh, lesser flats. Plant flag. Boing! There we go. Minmus. Lesser. Flats. Lifting off. Buckle your safety belts, please. And please retract the landing gear. There we go. We should be going due south. And we are. Good. Now let's make sure we don't crash in any mountains. I think we're safe from that. We're going to lose another fuel tank here in a second. Okay, stop right about there. I want to basically end up right there on the very bottom. We still have a little bit of fuel there. So we can go ahead and spin around. And turn that back to service. Because we're not interested in an orbit just yet. I'm really, I'm really, really pleased with the way that this mission turned out. I think we're going to be able to get all the science from the moon that uh, we're capable of getting right now. Although I guess we uh, we didn't bring enough science juniors, but besides that, we did pretty good.